Hi, I'm Rams linebacker James Laurinaitis, and we just got to Harrisburg, Illinois, um, taking a survey of the hardest hit part of the town and where unfortunately uh, people lost their lives in this area of Harrisburg, and you can kind of see the damage out there and um, how devastating it is. From here, we're going to go over to reveal a uh, new home to a single mother who uh, lost everything in the, in the tornado and then uh, gave birth on Tuesday. And so she thinks it's just going to be a few paint splotches and some carpet here and there. And it's actually going to be a whole revamped uh, place for her and also free rent for a whole year. So hopefully we'll get to see some smiles in the midst of all this tragedy. Hi, I'm Amy with the St. Louis Rams Cheerleaders. We're in Harrisburg, Illinois today with our mascot, Rampage, Ram staff, and a couple of players. We just unveiled a new home to Amanda, Trinity, and Caden with Operation Blessing. They were part of a big tragedy here in Harrisburg when the tornadoes hit and they completely lost everything they had. It was a great blessing to be here today and to experience the family's joy when they were able to see their new home that they were given. It's just a good opportunity just to be a small part of this and to help make their day. We are here at Harrisburg High School and uh, we just spoke to the students here about really rebuilding in this time of tragedy and, and drawing together and making sure that they support each other. We signed 10 footballs to give away to students and they had a raffle and we picked up some tickets and gave some footballs away. The cheerleaders were able to perform for them afterwards. The staff also threw out these little tiny little squishy footballs that were asked to get signed over and over, which are pretty, pretty cool little things. But it was good. I mean, we were able to, I think, really communicate a message that let them know that we care. And just spoke about the importance of them sticking together and truly um, loving each other during this time. And, and letting them know that even though we're in St. Louis two and a half hours away, that we truly care about them and uh, we love them. And that's what our whole purpose of being here today was. 